Here we are again at Sunset Lodge. And this time we do have lightning. We only manage a few trips. We got on the train a couple of times. High tides and plenty of water level checking. He's had quite a few now, Jeff. I think I'm going to get pneumonia. It's all right for these menopausal women, isn't it? I've been not flushes. They won't let me put the heating on. But they're shivering. There's a bit of dampness in the air. I'm going to cope with temping boring later. I was joking about using that frame, but I think there's every chance. Right, so I'm just going for a bit of a walk. Just, you've got to keep moving the joints, haven't you, they reckon? Thing is, the left calf, it's my right knee that's the but because I've been compensating by putting all the weight over to one side. My left calf is a bit sore. <coughs> well, I just looked at the weather forecast and it's supposed to be raining Wednesday, Thursday. And I haven't got the drone up yet. I'm caught marina. I suppose I could have done that now, couldn't I really? So, well, I don't think we're walking that far. We've got to walk up to the station. Then when we get off the station at Norwich, we're not far away from the Hollywood Bowl and Queen of Icini and all that. We're uh, around there and Wagamamas. <coughs> so, won't be too bad. Really easy yesterday. I feel a bit rough today. I think I've been poisoned. So what day is it now? Oh yeah, it's Wagamama's tonight. Tomorrow the girls are having um what is it called coming round? Hands, hands free. For the massage and facial or whatever they're having. And then they're going to do a, the grazing platter that they do normally when we're on holiday. And I think our plan is, if we get up in time, set off about nine o'clock and go to Loddon. Some lunch maybe in the... Hang about, the King's Head don't do food, do they? No, but you can go across the road to the chippy if it's open and take your chips in there. They don't mind you doing that. But, I don't, I don't know about that. Yeah, so... Wednesday, Alison's making... Tatus pop tea or something or other. Roast potatoes, I keep telling them. That's, that's all it is, roast potatoes. No, it's not. Uh, Thursday, we're going to the bay leaf. Indian. Friday we're going home. I'm going to let this wagon come past. So independence gets about a bit, doesn't it? It's been in, next to us, in the marina, it's been on the main river. And now she's here.
Yeah, it was different yesterday. Train down to Great Yarmouth. It's not going to be on the regular occurrence list, that's for sure. It's just something to, to do, isn't it? A bit different. It was a bit wet, so we, we, we was going to go on the boat, but it was a bit wet. And when you've got the choice, you see, if you're staying on the boat, you're on the boat, aren't you? You have no choice. So if you're staying in the lodge, the wheel's your lobster. Now, <coughs> I was asked or recommended that we try East Hills, but I don't think it's open. And that was Paul from Swancraft. Shadow boats. Well, I'm booked in for fuel. We've only been out for two hours. So far, I see me. Decking's a bit slippery. All the white iron's shut today. Um, I think it was one all at darts. Um, I think Carl pulled two games of snook uh, pull back on Sunday. Ooh, it is slippy on here. That would cheer me up, wouldn't it? I think you got my phone on, so I won't be able to on me, so I won't be able to ring him and say, "Come and pick me up." Ah, yes, yeah. It's now raining. So I wouldn't have been able to fly my drone properly. Yeah, it's only supposed to be cloudy, it's not supposed to be raining all week. How very dare it. Where are you going, Dave? Do you know? Should I do the up, round, down the road, up, round the road, and then down that way? I don't think we. Well, what time is it? Five past nine. We're not going out till quarter to twelve, I don't think. I'm not going over the steps. So, yes, they did do. Like uh, B and B with the boats more than the marina here. Yeah. And you were going like on for your breakfast. But now it's our turn so we're back to wearing them out I think. That's on the windscreen. Water babies. Hmm. Yeah, not down that way, that's the way we'll be going Wednesday, I think. If we do the walks, see what the weather's like. All the way down there, it just brings you out to the road anyway, and then you can go up to the shoulder of Mutton. I think that's the plan. We will see. Yeah, I tell you what. It's only been just over a week since I fell and I've not been doing much walking in fact for three days I couldn't even get out of the house so I can tell fitness levels have dropped I think it's partly because you're an old fart Dave right so you come up this path this just takes you on an order you've just seen this one before probably and just do a circular, come back, past the chippy and um, back down Whew. 
and I put my nice thick coat on because I felt cold before. Schoolboy era, and no sweating. Some nice houses around here. Yeah, so if you're interested in a, a share on the vault, there's quite a few shares for sale at the moment. I don't know whether it's the cost of living crisis or the recent floods that have restricted people from going, going out, but people's priorities change, don't they? So there's one on lightning. Um, that's £7,995. There's one on Thunder, I think William's asking 7000 for that. I could be wrong. I know Silver Cloud's got a share for sale, Moonlight Shadow's got a share for sale. Get in quick before the sea reclaims it all. Yeah, so great arm with yesterday. I think it was about an hour before I heard actually somebody actually speaking English. Yeah, we won't be doing our usual walk around Norwich. I could probably just about do that. Uh, I'm going to take my walking stick. Um, no, I'm not. I'll go on Wednesday. But Jeff, he's not so mobile. So I think it'll just be from the station to the Queen of Iceni until I think she's booked it for two o'clock. So. They recommend 20 minutes per person for two games. So that's two hours, isn't it? Whew. So then, yeah, Wagon Mamas. Which Christine's been a few times, her and Kim. I've never been. She keeps raving about it. I just have this... When she mentioned it, Japanese, I just thought of sushi straight away, and that put me right off. But it's not sushi. Um, katsu curry. Now she did buy a tub of the katsu curry from Asda. It's the only place that sells it. She, she shops at Tesco, but she'd done a, a shop at Asda for a change. And it isn't really nice, I like it. Um, so we'll see how the real one is today. We'll have some of that. This might not have been a good idea, actually. Coming out without a phone for a start. Can't phone clout, can I? Let's go and pick me up. And even if I borrowed somebody else's phone, I don't know any numbers. Oh, I, well, there you are. You see, I know my own. So I could ring that, but they'd just ignore it, wouldn't they? Right, so we're on the road. That way back up to Brundle. This way, what's it called now down that end? Um, oh dear, what is it called? Let's see if there's a sign. Well, that takes you down to Strumshaw. But we're not going that far this time. Yeah, can't see the, the signpost. 
but that's the way I will be coming back on Wednesday up the road. Yeah, I miscalculated that last time. I thought it was only half an hour from the lodge to the shoulder and mutton, but it's more like 45 minutes, nearly an hour. Hmm. Plastic, I ah, see that's Blowfield down that way. Oh, yeah, Cantley down that way. And Strumshaw. Now there is another pub up there, but it's a fair old walk. I think we did call in for one when we went to oh, I see, to see the seals last year. I think we stopped at the Acle Bridge on the way back and then that one up there and I can't remember what it's called, King's Arms or something. Possibly. Right, so your garage is here and chippy. Oh, I better put my camera away, it's getting wet now. You never know what time this chip is open. Seems to change every time we come. Carl walked up, didn't he, on Saturday, uh, Friday. It won't open. Look. Well, he didn't come up before five. Look at that, what a waste, doom bar. Right. John and Mary Ellen. Mm, yes, um, John. Five hundred thousand. Glasses are steaming up now. Six seven five offers in excess of. Mm, right. So the guy saw me looking in the window where, uh, and he came out of the shop, the estate agents there. And I thought, oh, here we go. It's another one who's giving me some grief about me filming, is it? Anyway, it wasn't. I think he would just have to sell me a house. I said, maybe when I win the lottery, mate, maybe when I win the lottery. But, uh, hmm. yeah, but, um, we, when Nathan left, <coughs> excuse me, I converted his bedroom into a bit of a gym with a treadmill and a exercise bike and a step machine and two weeks before somebody spiked me drink in the snooker club I'd started to use it again to get myself fit for this summer uh, the best laid plans as they say There. Oh, better out, I suppose. So that's where I came, that's where I went, wasn't it? That's a bit. Mm. Oh dear. I went out at Christmas with the lads that we used to play football, badminton, uh, do a lot of hiking with, which that seems to have 
gone by the wayside at the moment and we've done we did Snowdon we did Scarfell and we, the year after we were supposed to be doing Ben Nevis but I'd fallen like I did the other night on my other leg and twisted my left knee and another one of the lads had done his zipping so that got cancelled so they were all talking weren't they oh, let's do Snowden again so you forget don't you I, oh no they're marvellous <laughs> I'm not going up the steps you forget how hard it was um, it was a tough old climb that and it was steady in fact going up the thing I found that a lot easier than coming back down again. I don't like coming down hills. It's because of the weight load on your knees, isn't it? No, I'm not going up there because it'll take me an hour. £3 all day, annual season ticket, £328. All tickets expire at 4am. Hmm. It's about three pounds for parking all day is not too bad, is it? Salt. Some salt for the ice. Peacock salt. Right, there we go. Yeah, it's a bit damp. Is it just me or does everybody look up and down the train line when they're crossing a crossing like that? Even though the barrier's just gone up. Even when I'm driving across one, I don't like that. You never know, do you? Signal failure. What are you after? I'm not going on that deck and it's looking a bit slippy, doesn't it? Ooh, it's a bit wet as well. Not seen Donald and Jacqueline for a couple of days. Bin may have been this morning. It's a bit late. I'm on bin duties now. They might have us in it, eh? An old cripple. And we carry it bin out. Go to shed and get the beer car said. She's not speaking to me, is she? Yeah, I mean, there's this big black thing over the radiator, and I said, why are we drying the boat sails? I didn't know we had a blooming sailing dinghy. She said, that's my underwear. I don't know which one's which. Oh, they haven't been, have they? Unless they've just done the recycling. It's just me. 
first book. Yes, um, she said I bought some new knickers, but I don't like them. So I'm washing some, because I want some smaller ones for tomorrow. Wow, well, good he has going on tomorrow. So how, how far down is he going to go, this fella? I'm, I'll have to just, I'm not going, I'll have to keep my eye on her. Chaperone. And some smaller knickers for hands. Bloody hell's going on there. So anyway, I'm keeping moving. We're not going yet for another hour and a half. Oh well, nearly two hours. About 25, I think it's 22 minutes past 12 the train we're going to get. Only takes eight minutes. 20, yeah, so we're there for half past. I'll have to endure some more beer, I think. I don't, won't be drinking a lot today. I said that every day. Um, Yeah, two o'clock we booked in that for this ten pin. And about the ones that we go to locally, they don't give you shoes anymore, like you wear your trainers. And we went at Christmas and Nathan had some new trainers and he just left black marks all over the place. When I've looked at these trainers, they're very, very similar to the ones that he had. So I hope I don't do it. Right, because, well the one that I was is a tenpin place, and it's called Tenpin. This one here is the Hollywood Bowl. So, well it's brightened up a little bit. I suppose I could have flown me drawn, flown me drawn, drawn me flown, flew me drawn now, couldn't I really, but I haven't brought it. Yes. So it sounds like this fella's going to be called hands on, not hands free. Beans Seal Trips, Blakeney Point. Seal. And then I know I did this little walk on Saturday morning, wasn't it? But I didn't really pay much attention. And I'm looking for overhead obstacles. Um, yeah, because there's a lot of cables here. It looks, doesn't look like there is any in the marina. Yeah, it should be all right. So as long as the weather's permitting. Yeah, I can launch it from here. We've got a couple of masts, a couple of trees, but I should be all right. <laughs> Guess what? That is blowing around my ear rolls. Oh, oh what marvellous, marvellous. Just what I didn't need. Yeah. Should be alright here for a quick five minute fly. Oh dear. Mystique Lady. No, oh, that's Mystic Lady. Isn't it? Won't let it drop, you know, that Mystique. You remind me every time we come.
Oh, there's a table there, I could launch you off that. I've not seen anybody about. Clive normally works down this end. Yeah, that's better, off that table. Yeah. Like I say, weather permitting. Not off this decking because it's a bit near the water. Right. So that's the plan. All we need now is the weather. Don't want it too wet. Don't want it too windy. Right. We're getting the 22. 12 train, it's 22 minutes past 11. Um, yeah, that's extra half an hour in the pub, innit? I'm trying to avoid it. It stopped raining, but the bloody that thing that just makes everything move a lot, you know, what's it called? Um, Wind. Look at that. Been there nearly two hours and only had two pints. So this is the plan. We're going just across here to the Hollywood Bowl. We're a bit early. And then we're going to go across the, the, the way there to Wagga Mamas, which is a bit farther up. Bouncing ball, bouncing, bouncing ball. You just got a strike. Oh, it's quite a mess. Come on, Ace, mate. You can do it. I was taking a picture of you. Uh, I think I'm lo look at that. I'm joint last with you. <laughs> oh, she'd oh, she not hit the bumper. Oh. See, I've got a, an excuse anyway if I come last or when I come last. Right. It's, uh, Here's a lot. I'm, 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 I'm ampered. I'm ampered. I can't get my thumb in any of these balls. These kids are scoring more than us. So at the moment, I'm last. All the scores. Oh, bloody hell. Well, anyway, Carl won that one. I came second. I don't know about the rest of them. Pathetic, really. Scores, but second again on one leg. That I think that's all right. Right. So that's that. What time is it? Time is it? Five past four. Past two hours, wasn't it? Yeah. Well, two hours, weren't it? In there. We started at two o'clock. Mm. From crackers. Papa Doms. Right, here we are, Wagamamas. First time for everything. Bang bang cauliflower. No, you have to. Mm. Um, chicken sober. Chicken sober, something. Chicken and prawn, whatever that is over there, don't know. That's uh, oh look at this. Thank you very much. Enjoy chicken. Katsu curry. 178 pound 40. 
Okay, I think I've overfazed myself. Beer topping up. Struggling a bit. 178 pounds, something. Although Jeff and I sent a bottle of wine as well. Clayton Allison had dessert. Greedy, them two. <laughs> 